In mathematics, a Cohen Macaulay ring is a commutative ring with some of the algebra geometric properties of a smooth variety, such as local equidimensionality. Under mild assumptions, a local ring is Cohen Macaulay exactly when it is a finitely generated free module over a regular local subring. Cohen Macaulay rings play a central role in commutative algebra, they form a very broad class, and yet they are well understood in many ways. They are named for Francis Sowerby Macaulay, 1916, who proved the unmixedness theorem for polynomial rings, and for Irvin Cohen, 1946, who proved the unmixedness theorem for formal power series rings. All Cohen Macaulay rings have the unmixedness property. For Noetherian local rings, there is the following chain of inclusions. Universally catenary rings Cohen Macaulay rings Gorenstein rings complete intersection rings regular local rings Topic Definition For a commutative Noetherian local ring R the depth of R the maximum length of a regular sequence in the maximal ideal of R is at most the Krull dimension of R the ring R is called Cohen Macaulay if its depth is equal to its dimension More generally a commutative ring is called Cohen Macaulay if it is Noetherian and all of its localizations at prime ideals are Cohen Macaulay in geometric terms, a scheme is called Cohen Macaulay if it is locally Noetherian and its local ring at every point is Cohen Macaulay. Examples Noetherian rings of the following types are Cohen Macaulay. Any regular local ring this leads to various examples of Cohen Macaulay rings, such as the integers z, display style math b z, or a polynomial ring k x one x n, display style k x underscore one l dots x underscore n over a field k or a power series ring k x 1 x n display style k x underscore 1 l dots x underscore n in geometric terms every regular scheme for example a smooth variety over a field is cohen macaulay any zero-dimensional ring or equivalently, any Artinian ring. Any one-dimensional reduced ring, for example any one-dimensional domain. Any two-dimensional normal ring. Any Gorenstein ring. In particular, any complete intersection ring. The ring of invariance R G display style R caret G when R is a Cohen Macaulay algebra over a field of characteristic zero and G is a finite group, or more generally, a linear algebraic group whose identity component is reductive. This is the Hochster Roberts theorem. Any determinantal ring. That is, let R be the quotient of a regular local ring S by the ideal I generated by the R times R minors of some P times Q matrix of elements of S if the codimension or height of I is equal to the expected codimension, P minus R plus 1, Q minus R plus 1, R is called a determinantal ring. In that case, R is Cohen minus Macaulay. Similarly, coordinate rings of determinantal varieties are Cohen Macaulay. Some more examples. The ring K x, x squared has dimension 0 and hence is Cohen Macaulay, but it is not reduced and therefore not regular. The subring K t2, t3 of the polynomial ring K t, or its localization or completion at t equals 0, is a one-dimensional domain which is Gorenstein, and hence Cohen Macaulay, but not regular. This ring can also be described as the coordinate ring of the cuspidal cubic curve y2 equals x3 over k. 
The subring K T3, T4, T5 of the polynomial ring K T, or its localization or completion at T equals zero, is a one-dimensional domain which is Cohen-Macaulay but not Gorenstein. Rational singularities over a field of characteristic zero are Cohen-Macaulay. Toric varieties over any field are Cohen-Macaulay. The minimal model program makes prominent use of varieties with KLT Kuwamata log terminal singularities. In characteristic zero, these are rational singularities and hence are Cohen Macaulay. One successful analogue of rational singularities in positive characteristic is the notion of F rational singularities. Again, such singularities are Cohen Macaulay. Let X be a projective variety of dimension N1 over a field, and let L be an ample line bundle on X. Then the section ring of L R equals J 0 H 0 X L J Display style R equals big O plus underscore J G E Q zero H carrot zero X L carrot J is Cohen Macaulay if and only if the cohomology group high x l j is zero for all one i n minus one and all integers j. It follows, for example, that the affine cone spec R over an abelian variety x is Cohen Macaulay when x has dimension one, but not when x has dimension at least two, because h one x o is not zero. See also generalized Cohen Macaulay ring. Topic. Geometric consequences We say that a locally Noetherian scheme x is Cohen Macaulay if at each point x element of x in x the local ring O x X display style math call o underscore x x is Cohen Macaulay. Cohen Macaulay schemes have a special relation with intersection theory. Precisely, let X be a smooth variety and V W closed subschemes of pure dimension. Let Z be a proper component of the scheme theoretic intersection. V times X W display style v times underscore x w that is an irreducible component of expected dimension. If the local ring A of v times x w display style v times underscore x w at the generic point of Z is Cohen Macaulay, then the intersection multiplicity of V and W along Z is given as the length of A I Z V W X equals length A Display style I Z V C D O T W X equals operator name length A. In general, that multiplicity is given as a length essentially characterizes Cohen Macaulay ring, see hashtag properties. Multiplicity one criterion, on the other hand, roughly characterizes a regular local ring as a local ring of multiplicity one. For a simple example, if we take the intersection of a parabola with a line tangent to it, the local ring at the intersection point is isomorphic to c x y y minus x 2 c x y c x Y Y C X X two 
Display style FRAC Math B C X Y Y X carrot two O times underscore Math B C X Y FRAC Math B C X Y Y Kong FRAC Math B C X X carrot two which is Cohen Macaulay of length two, hence the intersection multiplicity is two, as expected. Topic: Miracle flatness or Hiranaka's criterion. There is a remarkable characterization of Cohen Macaulay rings, sometimes called miracle flatness or Hiranaka's criterion. Let R be a local ring which is finitely generated as a module over some regular local ring A contained in R such a subring exists for any localization R at a prime ideal of a finitely generated algebra over a field, by the Noether normalization lemma, it also exists when R is complete and contains a field, or when R is a complete domain. Then R is Cohen Macaulay if and only if it is flat as an A module, it is also equivalent to say that R is free as an A module. A geometric reformulation is as follows. Let X be a connected affine scheme of finite type over a field K, for example, an affine variety. Let n be the dimension of X by Noether normalization, there is a finite morphism f from X to a fine space and over K then X is Cohen Macaulay if and only all fibers of F have the same degree. It is striking that this property is independent of the choice of F. Finally, there is a version of miracle flatness for graded rings. Let R be a finitely generated commutative graded algebra over a field K. R equals K R one R two Display style R equals K O plus R underscore one O plus R underscore two O plus C D O T S there is always a graded polynomial subring A R with generators in various degrees such that R is finitely generated as an A module. Then R is Cohen Macaulay if and only if R is free as a graded A module. Again, it follows that this freeness is independent of the choice of the polynomial subring A. Topic. Properties. A Noetherian local ring is Cohen Macaulay if and only if its completion is Cohen Macaulay. If R is a Cohen Macaulay ring, then the polynomial ring R X and the power series ring R X are Cohen Macaulay. For a non zero divisor U in the maximal ideal of a Noetherian local ring R, R is Cohen Macaulay if and only if R U is Cohen Macaulay. The quotient of a Cohen Macaulay ring by any ideal is universally catenary. If R is a quotient of a Cohen Macaulay ring, then the locus p element of spec R, R p is Cohen Macaulay is an open subset of spec R. Let R, M, K be a Noetherian local ring of embedding codimension C, meaning that C equals d i m k meter per square meter minus dim R. In geometric terms, this holds for a local ring of a subscheme of codimension C in a regular scheme. For C equals 1, R is Cohen Macaulay if and only if it is a hypersurface ring. There is also a structure theorem for Cohen Macaulay rings of codimension 2, the Hilbert Birch theorem. They are all determinantal rings, defined by the R times R minors of an R plus 1 times R matrix for some R. For a Noetherian local ring R, M, the following are equivalent, R is Cohen Macaulay. For every parameter ideal Q an ideal generated by a system of parameters length R Q equals E Q Display style operator name length R Q equals E Q equals the Hilbert Samuel multiplicity of Q for some parameter ideal Q length 
R Q equals E Q Display style operator name length R Q equals E Q See generalized Cohen Macaulay ring as well as Buxbaum ring for rings that generalize this characterization. Topic: The unmixedness theorem. An ideal I of a Noetherian ring A is called unmixed in height if the height of I is equal to the height of every associated prime P of A I. This is stronger than saying that A, I is equidimensional, see below. The unmixedness theorem is said to hold for the ring A if every ideal I generated by a number of elements equal to its height is unmixed. A Noetherian ring is Cohen Macaulay if and only if the unmixedness theorem holds for it. The unmixed theorem applies in particular to the zero ideal, an ideal generated by zero elements, and thus it says a Cohen Macaulay ring is an equidimensional ring. In fact, in the strong sense, there is no embedded component and each component has the same codimension. See also, quasi-unmixed ring, a ring in which the unmixed theorem holds for integral closure of an ideal. Counterexamples If K is a field, then the ring R. K x y x two x y the coordinate ring of a line with an embedded point is not Cohen Macaulay. This follows, for example, by miracle flatness, R is finite over the polynomial ring A. K y with degree one over points of the affine line spec a with y does not equal zero, but with degree two over the point y equals zero because the k vector space k x x two has dimension two. If k is a field, then the ring k x y z x y x z the coordinate ring of the union of a line and a plane is reduced, but not equidimensional, and hence not Cohen Macaulay. Taking the quotient by the non-zero divisor x minus z gives the previous example. If k is a field, then the ring R equals k w x y z way w z x y x z. The coordinate ring of the union of two planes meeting in a point is reduced and equidimensional, but not Cohen Macaulay. To prove that, one can use Hartshorn's connectedness theorem. If R is a Cohen Macaulay local ring of dimension at least 2, then spec R minus its closed point is connected. The Sagra product of two Cohen Macaulay rings need not be Cohen Macaulay. <laughs> Grothendieck duality <laughs> One meaning of the Cohen Macaulay condition can be seen in coherent duality theory. A variety or scheme X is Cohen Macaulay if the dualizing complex, which a priori lies in the derived category of sheaves on X, is represented by a single sheaf. The stronger property of being Gorenstein means that this sheaf is a line bundle. In particular, every regular scheme is Gorenstein. Thus the statements of duality theorems such as Serre duality or Grothendieck local duality for Gorenstein or Cohen-Macaulay schemes retain some of the simplicity of what happens for regular schemes or smooth varieties. <laughs> <laughs> Notes <laughs>